Bienvenidos al show de Katika Living Vibrantly. ¿Cómo están hoy? Estamos tan contentos que ustedes están con nosotros ahora. Y qué show que tenemos para ustedes. Estamos orgullosos, contentos y es un honor tener a Charity Beck. Hello. Charity. Hola. ¿Cómo estás? ¿Qué pasa? Amiga? Ay, ¿Qué pasa? What up? What up? Esa charity, ya me hace reír todas las veces. I um, probably shouldn't say, but I me gusta es Spanish. Ah, oh, te gusta, yo lo sé. No, did I say Spanish no. is good looking or no? No, te I gusta love means it. I love, I it love Spanish. Yes, yes, perfecto, perfecto, yes, charity. Passionately. Muy bien, muy bien, charity. <laughs> Ella es la publicadora y fundadora de esta revista que se llama Positive Impact Magazine. Algo que es increíble todo el mensaje de la revista, sus artículos. Eh, ella va a compartir con ustedes cómo ella pudo realizar este sueño de ella um, y con toda la gente que ella trabaja para poner esta revista para ustedes uh, durante el año. Entonces vamos a hablar más con ella y cómo ella sigue inspirando a la gente, no solamente en la revista, pero siendo mamá de dos niños, teenagers, y también todas las cosas que ella hace para la comunidad también, para los jóvenes para los adultos y mucho más. Y en nuestro segmento de la comida, hemos tenido eh, varios emails y, y fotos de nuestros televidentes que han compartido con nosotros eh, diferentes comidas que han hecho después de ver el show de Katika Living Vibrantly. Entonces, hoy vamos a compartir eh, esa información con ustedes para, uh, para compartir y, y aprender uno con el otro. Entonces, quédense donde están o si quieren, cojan su... Eh, agüita con su agüita tibia con limón y se ponen bien cómodos porque aquí volvemos. Five, four, three, two, one. Ahora regresamos de nuevo. Gracias por estar con nosotros de ahorita aquí en el estudio de Tampa, en Talkwood Studios. Ahorita vamos a hablar con Charity Beck, que ella es la publicadora y fundadora de la revista Positive Impact Magazine. Pero antes que hablemos con Charity, vamos a hablar eh, y presentarle a ustedes eh, la, los, algunas fotos que hemos recibido de nuestros televidentes de las diferentes comidas que han tratado después de ver el show de Katika Living Vibrantly. Entonces, vamos a ver esta foto de Margie. Ella hizo la quinoa, que nosotros hablamos de la quinoa, hace como dos shows. Y aquí, el eh, productor Chris va a mostrar la mm, foto. Yummy. Ahí está. Mira, Cherry, mm. what do you think? It's, doesn't that look great? Delicioso. Delicioso, dice Cherry. Está chistosa. Como ustedes saben, Me el gusta. show va a ser bilingüe. Entonces, vamos a hablar en inglés y en español. Pero vean la foto, la de la quinoa. Ahí está. Y ella le puso 
mushrooms y le puso eh, pedacitos de carne. Entonces se ve delicioso. Margie, un beso. Gracias por compartir con nosotros eh, tus, eh, tu magia, tu cocina. Y ahora vamos, si ustedes no vieron el show de Katika sobre la quinoa y sobre el salmón que yo hice con um, esa, ese delicioso eh, salsa de aguacate, les recomiendo que vean ese show. Y aquí nuestro productor Chris puso un video para que ustedes puedan ver un poquito de esos ejemplos de, de las dos platos de cocina y a ver si ustedes pueden ver todo el show. Aquí está Chris. That was just awesome. Thank you, Chris, again, for putting that uh, video <laughs> together. Thank you very much. Thank that you. was awesome. And we were Delicious. able to kind of tease you guys a little bit. You can come and come back to the website and watch. Uh, those are two separate shows, the show, with the, soap, the show with quinoa and then the show with the salmon with the delicious avocado hollandaise sauce. So, and someday a show with Chris. Yes. Fishing, fresh fish. Absolutely great idea. We're talking right about fish the, during the out break. Out of the ocean, <laughs> onto the We love delicious. it. Well, we'll get right to you, Miss Terry. Thanks so great to oh, see you. you. I'd love oh, to have you here on the show. Thank How you are for you? for having me. Thank you, everyone, so awesome. for watching. Yeah, so awesome to have you and be part of it and, and um, share with us. You know, well, let me share with our, our bilingual audience um, a little bit about the magazine. Um, She, I mean, first of all, this magazine, if you haven't seen it yet or you haven't been able to um, uh, see it on, on, on digitally or a uh, print copy, I promise you that after this show, you guys are all going to subscribe to it because it's unbelievable, not only the wonderful articles, but that positive energy, that different approach versus what's out there in, in general. And it's such a wonderful, refreshing reminder that this is what life's about. So we are just so honored and grateful to have Charity. Um, this is her baby, her dream, and she lives this every day and how she continues to not only inspire her readers but all of her community friends and the world because she's done such amazing work. But we, we know we're going to have to have you back because she has lots to share. But we'll start today. <laughs> <laughs> so um, I'd love to read to our viewers, um, and then if Chris can pull up the slide, what the intention is for the magazine. It's beautiful. Do you want to read it? It's all about solutions. Um, mm -hmm. I believe in focusing on it is what it is. It's not right or wrong, good or bad. It, it is what it is. Let's, let's learn from it and get the solution and the blessing, in my mm -hmm. opinion, in That's my experience, beautiful. actually. Mm -hmm. So um, what do you want me to read? No, right here. He's going to pull up the, the little slide. Right there. Oh, in, the, on our, in the yeah, magazine, no, our yeah. welcome page, our intention We are a multimedia resource for sharing stories, ideas, actions that inspire, educate, encourage, and provide solutions that will last in a worldwide positive change. That's awesome. I love it. And I, it really is the essence of the whole magazine, right? That, yes. So tell us how all we, this evolved. We're a resource. We're more than the magazine. We're, we are a print and digital magazine. We are the website daily, we're the app daily, we're the social networks, we're the newsletter, we are the radio show and TV show launching sometime, awesome. the network. Um, there are so many amazing things going on in the world that we just, we love sharing. And But you share with the purpose. It's the solutions, mostly, and there's, instead of hearing what's wrong and the vibrant, you know, mm -hmm. we have mm -hmm. food and... You're going to be contributing yes, to regular so column Let's with tell food. Our viewers, but, yes, ahead, yes. No, you, you. <laughs> it's all about the show. And yes, um, Cherry and I, gonna, she's been wonderful and a blessing. And I'm going to be working with her and being a monthly contributor to the column, the print 
magazine. And, the blog, and, and the then website. the blogging, which is going to be every week, right? You blog. can do yeah. that daily or whatever. Daily, yes. Oh, daily. Okay. And that's going to be the digital that's copy. Daily. So, and then we're talking about the radio show as well. So, lots of wonderful things that we're going to work together on to actually um, continue evolving both of our messages because they are right aligned. Yes. Um, in, in, the, in so many ways. So, I'm grateful. And we can talk about the Positive Impact Awards and yes, celebration. Yeah, talk about that. If you know somebody, a book, an author, or a film, or a person, a teacher, a doctor, your neighbor, a child, youth, the, the young unsung heroes, we call them the young pioneers. Uh, send them our way, nominate. We want to celebrate them and honor them, and then we'll have a big event. We have a yearly event this year. It's going to be at Nova 535 in St. Pete. Nice. Very nice venue. You're all invited. That's awesome. And then you get more information on the website, so go ahead yes. and tell them the website. Yes, and we'll, we'll share with you. Yeah, we'll put it on our website as well. Yes, and through Facebook, you can send nominees on the fa Positive Impact page, fan page, the website, and we'll send ballots out, and there's... You know, just feel free to contact me. You can email me direct. Oh, great. Okay, we'll put that information also on the website mm -hmm. so that they have all the information. And I want to share the digital copy with all of your re your viewers, and it's exciting oh, that you're going to awesome. be a part of it because you're so vibrant in the food. And we have, along with you, we have Jeff that's and right. Dr. Furman and the Healthy Apple. Oh, that's awesome. They're right up your alley, all your viewers' alleys. Yes. You know. It's yes, awesome. and that, that is, like you said, it's all part of living vibrantly and being able to continue that message. Um, and, and it is a positive energy that we're putting out there. Um, because when, when you do you live in that type of environment and you're constantly in that state of mind, of uh, that peace and that energy of, of, of knowing that there's a positive versus looking at the other side of things, which generally don't put you in such a positive and, notion yeah and not so much judgmentally like yeah. it isn't good or bad or right or wrong yes some things don't feel good those are usually the ones that you learn the most i learn the most from right. the ones that you feel the most so mm -hmm. positive and negative not not as a judgmental way but just finding really looking at what is and going from there and you can you there's a choice you have choices and what your true heart's desire with your words and the way you look at things. Right. You can look at it from different perspectives. And I like to look at things as, you know, positive impact solution. Right, right, right. This is beautiful. But, yeah, this is a true representation of what you live, what you believe in. So that's beautiful how that's full circle. But tell our viewers, how, how was it that first time that you had that first inclination that you needed to do something different versus your... Uh, background in photography. So mm -hmm. how did that evolve? So I work for different publications and people would joke my name is Charity. It means love. And people would joke and say, you should start your own magazine and call it Charity Magazine. Charity. I would say, <laughs> haha, yeah, right. I have no time to tie my shoe. Right, right, right. That how is being, this going to happen? Yes. Um, and then my son and I were headed to the World Peace Conference in Spain and I had an wow, accident awesome. where I was laid up. And I watched TV for the first time in a long time, and I couldn't believe the negative slant on a, a lot of things. Mm -hmm. And at 3 o'clock in the morning, ding, 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 wake up, and I thought I can help change people's minds. I called my childhood friend, Jen Hellman, mm -hmm. and I said, let's put up this website, and it just took off. And wow. people really desire to focus on the solution and hear about the amazing things that are going on. And there are so many things going on right. we can be daily magazine every day and we are daily on the website, on the website. And there's just amazing great things going on just so it's a story that um actually brings you like a story that comes to mind that you never forget you know there's always one story one person that you interview or one experience that you know you Bring to your mind ever soft. Is there one or two or several? There's so many. Okay, well, and each magazine is so special to me. Every ma magazine, each one has a place in my heart. And yeah, really? Yes. Oh, I'm excited awesome. about the next one. We have an amazing, it's becoming magical. David Copperfield's on the cover. Oh, wow. That's awesome. It's magical. It's just it continues that inspirational note I'm too. Thinking the of the word magical yeah. <laughs> that and that comes to mind because it's coming down to the words and being in the now and being 
so present. Yeah, because there, there's an article of a doctor. He lost his his daughters and mm. wife were murdered, and he wow. wasn't. He doesn't hate and want revenge from it. He found Is a place. Is this a doctor in, or, in Ohio? He's actually in Sarasota, Florida, oh, Sarasota. Florida believe it or not. Oh, okay, okay. He's right. a professor, and he started a foundation wow. in honor of his daughters and wife that so that they didn't die for a non-purpose, wow. like using that as a solution. Versus, and there's just mm -hmm. amazing things like that. And then um, we have an interview with this 97-year-old. He met Einstein. There's a lot of things wow. with Einstein, this issue, magical oh, wow. and um, what's the word for Einstein? What comes oh, to mind? Um, uh, let's see. He just, is so scientific. He is no, just so... He was inventive, so inventive, you know, yeah, like inventive. magical, but, inventive, mm -hmm. and and so he met Einstein when he was younger, and he there's a machine that he created that cures all these disease, heart disease, diabetes, and wow. it's non-invasive, no and drugs, no surgery. Yes, what? and he lives. <gasps> the machine helps people live again, walk again, and it's non-invasive. It's it wow. no drugs, no. Mm -hmm. So he's going to be featured in the next four to eight magazines he's wow. amazing so we're we are especially featuring that machine the eecp machine eecp I need the baser medical research. yes because i haven't yes. heard about that i'll definitely we can yes. get him on the show oh i'd love he's to amazing. oh my gosh I would, that's a great idea i'd love to have him on the show so he can continue sharing with us and educating us these yes. new progressive changes that healthcare is taking that's terrific yes it's um and then you're going to be a regular contributor with yes. Vibrant Living. And then we ha always have great food and Dr. Furman. And we have um, celebrities. There are always, there's so many celebrities that are doing great things. And unfortunately, we hear about their DUIs or something. And that's not what, to right. me, that's not news. I want to hear about the things that bring joy, joy. And love. Yeah, joy to that. Uh -huh. your true heart's desire. Right, right, and I was right. telling you the last show that, um, I just recently learned that uh -huh. after your heart is developed, when you're developing in your mother's stomach, that your tongue is the second thing after your heart. Oh, I might... that actually is okay. I did the same thing so, earlier. I kept hitting our microphones. So if you guys hear that. us, we apologize. We are very animated, as you can tell. I'm getting blood. <laughs> I'm somebody's giving we me. We enjoy talking with yeah, our hands. Passionate. Actually, we put the magazines down about... this time. <laughs> okay, I'll sit on my hands. And... But as, as Charity was saying, it's very interesting with the heart and the tongue. That right. the tongue's the second to develop in the mom's womb. So they're not kidding. When you speak from your heart, you're same. really speaking your true heart's desire. And I've been studying the word lately. There's conscious language and Robert, and um, they're going to be contributing to the magazine, too. That's and, terrific. What and an we, honor. You know, we get sent a lot of books and things to review. There's uh -huh. so many great books out there, and there's yeah. so many great films and, right. you know, advice and tips and so that's going to be encouraging too because as you continue your movement you see that there are others also following oh, yes. that that call that need mm -hmm. and they're doing it on their own path and then they're they're hoping you know to join forces with you or someone else but continue that awesome hopefully evolving all of us mm -hmm. because as one changes it connects as you yes. know we're all connected so it, yes. it it continues to evolve yes oh that's, oh, that's coming up big time yeah. connection being in the now being grateful love wow and that's all love the next to issue? everything even loving the your opportunities to learn i've yes. learned when i accept it and love it it just it's it becomes, becomes magic yeah, yeah it, <laughs> you it, took yeah, the words right yeah. out of my mouth <laughs> I love that. You know why? I'm because trying to sit on my hands too, by the way, so I don't. <laughs> no, make no, loud don't sit on your hands. You're so funny. I don't want to bang the microphone no, anyway. I'm sure Chris would be fine with it. <laughs> Chris, sorry. <laughs> I'm getting it. Oh, no, no. no. We love, Charity, uh, we love your animation, your energy, your passion behind what you do. No, we don't want you to feel, you know, restricted. No, no, no. Just don't pop so, out of the chair. Because then you I might. might. Especially lately, I was going to tell you about the book that I was just reviewing. It's oh. actually been on my desk for six months or so doc, by Dr. Wayne Dyer. Him oh. and Deepak Chopra, they write a book every oh. week. And it's amazing, right? I thought, oh, it's probably similar to the last one. No, I was wrong. I, it was an audio book, and I put it in, and just a really great reminder. No kidding. It's called Which Excuses Be Gone. Oh, I've and, heard of that, but I haven't read that one Well, it's, a, it's about speaking from your heart and all the memes and the programs that we believe and right. get stuck in and, and 
there's a choice in different angles to look at things. And it was a really good it's reminder beautiful. because I know that, and it was nice to be And like we talked of, earlier, it, there is always that reminder. Um, mm -hmm. We do know which is the appropriate approach to take. It's just that sometimes we're so uh, inundated with different different ideas from society, from our families, from limited, our... Limited, yeah. yeah. And, they're and limited. you're not... No, no. You are not limited. No. You can do... If I am able to do this... Wow. You've done so you much. You can do whatever you desire and follow your heart and speak from your heart. And sometimes you have to be quiet and just... Yeah, because silence is also part of learning and mm -hmm. being able to receive what you need to be reminded of. Remember <laughs> to remember. That's why I've always loved the I movie... Love um, Lion King from Disney. You know, I'm a big oh, Disney that. fan, I love that. <laughs> as my fans will know. Mm -hmm. And um, one of the things, I've always loved that scene that when the dad comes back, the, the lion dad, he tells Simba, remember to remember. And oh, I always thought, oh, it's so beautiful. That. It is. We all need to remember to remember because mm -hmm. we all have this innately. So, But it's beautiful to see someone like you, not only you're beautiful outside, but inside in your soul, so oh, loving. Yes. And um, being able to see her dream come into fruition. I mean, what an inspiration for all of us. That's been a gift of mine to see the beauty in things. And Yeah, well, thank you. That's such a nice compliment. I'm a mirror of you. Oh, thank all you. All of you are. So yes, that's right. I believe that's right. that. And um, I wanted to share with our viewers how beautiful in our last show, in our English segment, um, we did, uh, Charity was sharing with me these beautiful gifts that she brought me. You want to tell our viewers a little bit about these beautiful the bracelets? blessing bracelets. Yeah. So mm -hmm. um, when they're made, yeah. made as intended, they bless it with love or whatever for whoever's going to be wearing it. And then there's Swarovski beads and the silver's um, really good silver too. And then as you wear it on your wrist, and you, we all look at our wrist several times a day, it's a, it's a reminder to think of at least four things, eight things that you're grateful for or thankful for. Whichever you choose. They are absolutely exquisite. Not only are they so fashionable, and I was telling um, Cherry, this very sexy kind of look, but it's <laughs> such a, it's also blessing. Blessing, <laughs> yes. You attract blessings in your life when you think about what you're grateful mm -hmm. for. And I tell the children that I speak to, I speak a lot to children. I love the youth, the young. I love everyone, but. Yeah, and everybody um, loves charity, no as you can tell. <laughs> She's um, hard not to love. I can't imagine no, anyone sweet. not loving uh -huh. charity. That's awesome. Well, I love children. They have a special place in my heart, and I encourage them to to write something that they're grateful for. I read years ago to write ten, at least ten things that you're grateful for, mm -hmm. and it doesn't have to be this huge thing. I mean, it could be flowers. I like to laugh till my stomach hurts. I want to change yeah. it. I like to laugh until I feel it I everywhere. Feel it. Yeah, that's I mean, right. Refraining. Flowers. <laughs> it can be breathing. Mm -hmm. It's the candle. I mean, it can be so simple. I'm it's and magic happens. I tell the kids that. And this one child, um, he's thirteen or fourteen. Right. He sent his gratitude list to me every night for thirty days straight. Thirty over. days. He said actually he was going over the thirty days. So I thought that was great. Well, how you inspire that child to well speaking, incorporate it because it became part of his life. It it, it wasn't just an assignment or a suggestion. Right. Right. It'd be cute. He did what we all should do, and that's integrate into our life that's so natural it's not even something to do it's something we we are it's in the flow it's 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 as natural your as brushing heart. your teeth you know <laughs> yeah. something really because how many of us do actually put on your list okay today i'm going brush to brush my, my teeth, teeth. toilet yeah. sink <laughs> so exactly those are things not to be taken for granted right. because without them but we don't put it on to-do list so this yeah. is a wonderful reminder that mm -hmm. you inspired this child not only to do it for 30 days, but go ahead. Now he took it a step beyond that and said, no, I'm going to do it beyond 30 days. So mm -hmm. I think that's Well, and, and on that note, too, the youth, we have the youth mm -hmm. writing program where oh, we wow. encourage children of all ages to send in photos mm -hmm. or write about things that have a positive impact in their life or in the world. So wow, it encourages awesome. them to look for solutions. And there's no limit. There's you. It will be published and on the website or in the magazine mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and if there's a teacher involved we give them credit too so. that's awesome so parents you need to stay tuned to that and check it out on our website because we'll connect yes over to you 
so and that they can get all the details and have your kids get involved or your teachers. And if you involved. contact me direct, I'm happy to talk to the students of class or anything. Oh, that would be about great. That. So definitely, and they can contact you through the website. There's mm -hmm. an email address. Yes. Great. And that being said, I t we cover topics from A to Z, from animals to unsung hero to to the environment, to conservation, films, books, celebrities, food. Wow, that's awesome. Music. 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 Yeah. Music. Better not yeah. sing. I'm, I'll really scare everybody. <laughs> I'm banging the microphone. No, I'm singing. you're not banging the microphone. But what a wonderful array of different uh, topics and categories. And so, you know, it's just amazing. I was, I was telling you earlier that I read, um, I was reviewing some of the magazines you had sent me. And then there was the one article that you know we always need we always need to be rem reminded about something. And sure enough, it was it was talking about time being an illusion, and I had just had this conversation earlier <laughs> with a couple of friends, and then to be given this this gift back because as as Charity was sharing these magazines for me to review for the show, here it was again a reminder about time being an illusion. So um, it's just from the moment you open the magazine, the first page, like I said. We already read that uh, intention, what their intention is to the last page. Um, it's just amazing and how this can actually not only inspire you, but you can uh, possibly help someone else who you may know is going through some tough times. I'm mm. sure you get that too. Mm. Uh, and all of a sudden mm. this becomes a resource for mm -hmm. health, a resource for uh, um, things of the mind and helping you live mm. that more positive frame of mind. Yes. Tell me about a, that. It's a it's, in my opinion, it's a beautiful book. It's a mm -hmm. coffee table book. It's, yes. it's a resource. You don't want to throw it away, or I don't, at least. No, you can't. But it, it is truly a resource. And there's so many great things going on in the and, world. And, it, and, and it's funny, when articles come in, I, I theme the books. I work on doing that, and then they end up taking a life of their own. And I was telling you earlier mm -hmm. that sometimes when the, I'm reading the articles, I'm like, wow, I really needed this article that we're yes, reviewing for yeah. the magazine. It's just because we cover parenting relationships and relationships, not just romantic relationship, but relationships, things that you can apply to all of them. Mm. Being That's grateful, so love, forgiveness, you know, things like just, mm -hmm. yeah. So there's, yeah. yeah that, that is amazing. And like you said, relationships, something. The mind. Yeah. <laughs> the mind, right. And being that state of love and peace, right. it's, is a lot easier joy. said than done, but enjoy, yes. But. Well, and when you get out of your own self, you know, I found mm -hmm. people challenge me or devil's advocate and question, well, when you're having a bad day, Charity, what's the best way to get out? And I say, you know, doing something for someone else usually helps me immediately, even if it's awesome. opening a door. You really get out of that In your own perspective. Right, perspective. right, right your own little bubble yes. that we tend to. Because that's human nature. Paying it forward. And they would pay it forward. That's right. Oh. So a lot of the kids that I talk to, the uh -huh. children that I speak to, they haven't even heard of Pay It Forward the movie or the Nothing. movement. Yes. I, I really encourage it in the high schools because I hear. Which that. reminds me, she gave me this beautiful bracelet, too. It says Pay It Forward. It's so a, talk, another reminder another when you reminder. wear it on your right wrist, Charlie. Mm -hmm. He's it's awesome. Worth, and um, uh -huh. Catherine Randhide, she wrote the book. She wrote the book, uh-huh. Got a nose itch. Yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> but that that's a wonderful reminder and that goes along with my beads right okay good because i need to wear these so i remember to pay it forward and like we were talking before um paying it forward is is something as simple as opening a door mm. or um, smiling smiling yeah it doesn't the, have to be that used to be the third contagious thing in the world smiling or yeah. it was maybe further up the line yawning really? was up there too ah, i don't know if it's funny. still i would be interested to know what's the most contagious thing yeah okay. smiling used to be the number one wow that's I'm sad not that sure. it used to be right let's get it back everybody. yes we, let's well get you're back. on the road to that for sure <laughs> smiling is so, so what contagious. what other projects are you involved with or that you we see? have a lot of things yeah. looking forward like the the positive impact awards and celebration yep, I, we April talked about 24th, that uh -huh. send in your nominees through the Facebook, through the website, through your site. Yes, absolutely, through, through our website, too. Through email and more. And then we have Positive Impact Travel launching this year. We're going to start off with Excellent. three trips this year where we take people on trips, and they don't have to do the research or do the flights and all that. We do it that. Yeah. And we take them somewhere that has a positive impact in their life, like the seven natural wonders of the world. Oh. 
I'm there. The pilgrimage I think I think Spain. I need to be part of that project so I can yes. bring it home too. Yes. <laughs> and then we have the radio show and relaunching. The, yes, it's so exciting. And a new website, February yes. 3rd. Yay! I'm That's excited. That's awesome. So we need to celebrate on February 3rd that new website <laughs> as well. That's great. I keep singing. <laughs> I think it's beautiful. That's what this show is about. It's living vibrantly in charity. You are the essence of that through your work, through your personality, um, your beautiful soul, everything that you do, everything you touch. So, and you've touched so many people, um, and you can tell through what you're doing and what you continue to do for others. And I just can't wait to have you back on the show. Thank you. Because you've been I'm awesome. I'm here of you. you. Thank you. And um, sister so Manavista. excited. Sister <laughs> Sorry, soul sisters. And we're so excited that we're going to be able to work together um, through the positive impact. Um, yes, watch out. Watch our blog, daily yeah. blog, daily and her blog, column in the magazine, and the column in the magazine. And then we're also going to do the radio. So mm -hmm. that's going to be super exciting for all of us because it, it's just another piece of the puzzle that works together to bring you that message that we want to bring home to everyone, which is um, that living vibrantly, positive change, and working together to help others reach that goal as well. Because once you reach that goal, it's just bliss, right? Mm -hmm. Because life happens. We all go Blessing. through our challenges. I'm a living miracle. See? A living miracle. See? That, so <laughs> we need, we need to have another show on this living miracle. <laughs> <laughs> so thank you so much for coming. You have been a phenomenal thank guest. Thank you. And Thanks for always having me. Inspiring Thanks for me. watching and listening. And Thank you. Thank well, you, you thank need you, to come you. back. You promise? I promise. Okay. I'll be back. Awesome. Awesome. Ok, televidentes, gracias por sintonizar con nosotros esta noche. Estamos muy contentos que estuviste con nosotros y que pudimos compartir eh, este, esta muchacha que es algo increíble lo que haya, ella ha hecho, Charity Beck, con su revista, con uh, sus proyectos, en, no solamente en este país, pero en el mundo entero. Entonces, estamos contentos que pudimos llegarles a ustedes con este mensaje y que puedan ver la revista, acuérdense, por el website aquí en caticatv.com o y ahí pueden ir al website de Charity para que cojan más información de la revista y de los proyectos que vienen ahora. Y como siempre, estamos muy agradecidos que estuvieron con nosotros. Un beso y los vemos la semana entrante. Bendiciones. Gracias. Gracias.